With new actions taken to address the COVID-19 threat, hindsight is still very much underway. For your consideration, a story and outcome you probably aren't hearing much about anywhere else. It takes place in the heart of Amish country. Lancaster County, Pennsylvania. Thousands of families lead lives largely separate from modern America. The Amish are a Christian group that emphasizes the virtuous over the superficial. They don't usually drive, use electricity, or have TVs. And during the COVID-19 outbreak, they became subjects in a massive social and medical experiment. So it's safe to say there was a whole different approach here in this community when coronavirus broke out Absolutely. than many other places. Absolutely. Calvin Lapp is Amish Mennonite. There's three things the Amish don't like, and that's government. They won't get involved in government. They don't like the public education system. They won't send their children to education, and they, they also don't like the health system. Uh, they, they rip us off. Those are three things that we feel like we're fighting against all the time. Well, those three things are all part of what COVID is. After a short shutdown last year, the Amish chose a unique path that led to COVID-19 tearing through at warp speed. It began with an important religious holiday in May. When they take communion, they, 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 they dump their wine into a cup and they take turns to drink out of that cup. So you go the whole way down the line and everybody drinks out of that cup. So if one person has coronavirus, the rest of the church is gonna get coronavirus. First time they went back to church, everybody got coronavirus. Lapp says they weren't denying coronavirus, they were facing it head on. It's the worst thing to quit working than dying. But to shut down and say that we can't go to church, we can't get together with family, we can't see our old people in the hospital, we gotta quit working. You're working, it's going completely against everything that we believe. And you're, you're changing our culture completely to try to act like they wanted us to act the last year. And we're not gonna do it.